All right, we just. I uh, we did some leg day today. Did some squats. What did you think we were gonna do though? Oh, we we're gonna do pull day. You know, a push day, man. <laughs> Fucking, that's why I did some upper body workout warm up. <laughs> These guys, they wanted me to do some squats and deadlifts. Yeah. Fuck that shit. And that is how we make sure we get our friends do to not have up. stick legs, man. Although I still got the stick leg. Shit. Let's go. God damn, celebrity for just a feel what? Fuck it, do squat! Mate, do yeah, squat! Mate, it's like do squat! Leg day, bro. It's leg day, bro! Leg day! Matt Greetings family, uh, we're back with the informative voiceover for this leg session. We kick things off with some full body warm up and stretches. The first two exercises is always a compound movement for us, no matter what day it is. And in this video you will see that me and Ali is doing the front squat, whereas the Kunjal is doing the back squat. We train legs twice a week, so on the first day of leg day we do a back, back squat with a conventional deadlift, whereas on the second day we do front squat with a sumo deadlift which we will see in this video there's few people who ask us about the front squat like why we do it it's cause like it targets the quads muscles like no other exercise maybe because of the placement of the barbell being held in front of you instead of behind you like in a back squat and also like if you have like a lower back problem like me chances are you can do them without any problem unless you got some serious back problem like cause uh, uh it will have a less impact on the spinal compression because of the position of the barbell. Anyway, moving on to the next compound movement is our sumo deadlift. Sumo deadlift activates full body muscles like quads, hemis, glutes, lower, upper, back, core, arms, shoulders, traps, everything. You need to have a very flexible hips in order to perform uh, this wide stance sumo deadlift. That's why you need to do more warm up and stretches compared to while performing a conventional deadlift. But that's just my personal point of view. Anyway, we're doing four sets of four over here with the weight 152.5 kilo. Our third exercise is a seated uh, leg curl, which focus on uh, hamstring mainly. We target to do off three sets of 15 reps, but then it all depends on how much you can do it. But until you hit the three sets of 15, you don't increase the weight. Moving on to our fourth exercise is a leg extension workout. Basically the same rep range and same formula. We just do this for three sets of 15 reps until you hit the target, you don't increase the way and we finished off our workout with the three sets of 15 reps on this calves machine so yeah that's gonna conclude this workout guys and also thanks to be back he's helping us with the photos and videos for our new t-shirt which will be out next year 10th of january to mark our anniversary so i really appreciate you all and keep supporting matt desire thank you very much for that i hope you guys really like the footage and commentary we'll see you guys in the next couple of days sayonara <laughs> that's what it feels like the leg day like, well,